Welcome to Super AGI. In this video, I will demonstrate you how to set up your own instance of Autonode. You can also find a detailed step-by-step -step guide of installation on Autonode's GitHub repository. We've added the link to repo in the video description. To begin with, open up your terminal and clone the Autonode repository. For this demonstration, I'm going to speed up the video to fasten up the installation. Once the installation is done, open the root directory of the cloned repo in your choice of code editor and find the .env.example file. Make a copy of this file and rename it to .env. Fill in your OpenAI API key. You could also host YOLO and OCR services remotely and enter both remote URLs in the same env file. Now, open the OCR folder in the root repository and repeat the process of cloning .env file. In this case, fill in the OCR remote URL. Now again, repeat the same process for YOLO folder as shown in the video. Once done, open the terminal within the code editor, run the following command. Docker space compose space hyphen f space docker hyphen compose dot yell space up hyphen hyphen build. Make sure you have Docker installed in your system and it's up and running. Once you hit enter, the Autonode installation will start and you should be able to see the Autonode service running on Docker. Once the installation is finished, you can check the Autonode running status by visiting the following URL localhost colon 8001 slash health. I've also mentioned this URL in the video description. On this URL, you should see something like this to ensure your Autonode instance is successfully running. Now to start using Autonode, visit localhost colon 8001 slash docs. Hit the try it out button and paste the request structure of JSON payload you want to send to endpoint. In this video, we will take an example of Papa login. You can find the example request in the realm of our GitHub repo. Please make sure to use your own login credentials. And that's how you can install and get started with using Autonode in your local machine. In our upcoming videos, we will go deeper into how to use Autonode for Apollo, Gmail, and Twitter automation. Thanks for watching. See you next time.